Thanks for reading. Yeah, thank you for listening. Okay. Going to do the dream. If you have a dream that has a drama and the drama reaches a conclusion, go to the conclusion. <laughs> really. I like that. To the last paragraph. <laughs> I realize that it's coming back and I'm trying to think of other ways but while I'm thinking that I start leaving it behind and flying away I know that I need to run away because it's about to come out again as I'm flying I realize that my flying is not as fast because it's having an effect on me that I can't beat this thing then I realize that it's following me again and it's flying behind me and I'm thinking that because I know how resilient it is now I lost my motivation, my drive to fly as I did before. I have a disadvantage now and it's going to get me. It's going to be a lot harder now to get away from it. I think it may have gotten stronger. Maybe it gets stronger when it overcomes challenges like that. It keeps getting closer. Oh. Go ahead. What are you talking about? Well, I, I saw the power of this thing mm -hmm. and I mm -hmm. lost... It's kind of like it, it um, outwilled me. So I, I, uh, I'm kind of deflated now. <clears throat> yeah, go ahead. Uh, what is it? The thing? Yeah. It's some very persistent, s weird alien thing yeah. 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 which is coming after me yeah. Yeah. what is it? what is it? Mm -hmm. I don't know but don't know? In, the, in the dream I, I think it's gonna hurt me or kill me but I have a, I have a feeling that there is no real proof for that I don't, I don't, I'm not sure that it's going to hurt me, reflecting on it now. But in the dream? Um, no, in the dream I thought it was going to... At the beginning I definitely thought it was going to hurt me or kill me. Uh, but later... Look here. All the, all the ways in which you describe that, it, the effect that it has on you, you can state, can you not? Yeah. Yeah. Now we're going to take the, the description of each and say, as you take them all together, when, do you, when have you experienced that? I, I, what, what comes to mind is when I'm pursuing a meaningful goal yeah, yeah, and yeah, yeah. I've been doing it for a while mm -hmm. and I'm starting to see some success. Mm -hmm. uh, that's when I kind of get overwhelmed by 
by considering how much more work I'm going to be putting into this. And what does that do to you? And that that does this this thing, this very uh, it it kind of uh, deflates me. No, no. <clears throat> Therefore, can you risk a conclusion? What all of these things mean? Well, I, th I think I'm running away from something good. Of course. <laughs> of course. Um. So think about it while I talk to Barbara. Okay. Yeah. Hey, Barbara, do you find it curious that our colleague has an answer and he doesn't know he gave it? Yeah, I do find But I, I have to admit, I've been in that position myself. But oh. yes, for the sake of the argument, I'll find that oh. curious. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> I wonder, yeah, go ahead. I gave an answer? What do you mean? Well, we were just having a private talk. <laughs> <laughs> I don't... Um, no, I don't. don't add. Okay. You can ask a question, but don't it's add. Like, okay. It's kind of like, I'm afraid where it'll go, or something if I keep going. Yeah. Um, what's it? My my growth, my. Um, That's true. Um, where it will That's go. That's true. <clears throat> but uh, what activity are you worried about? Looks like you have a judgment about it, don't you? Yeah, it's curious. <clears throat> yeah, I'm. Um, something about the. Something about the. Immensity of it. Oh yeah. It's something. <laughs> oh yeah, it's immense. Oh, what's the it that's immense? I, I think uh, it has to do with the work that's involved. Oh, what's the word again? Work. Oh, oh, oh. But it's look, it's look also here. look here. You already gave the answer. Yeah. You have an idea of work which is destroying your creative effort to succeed. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about it. Yeah. Hey, uh, what might happen if you become more successful? Lots of things. Come on. Lots of good things. How about the worries you have about it? Oh, uh, oh! What might happen? Yeah. What bad thing might happen? Yeah. Um, what might happen. Uh, so you've already said it. I am afraid where it will go if I continue. 
What is that fear? Come on. It's like I'm going to... Mm, it's like I'm going to lose myself or something no like more. that. Come on, lose yourself. Come on. It's like... Um, That's major. Yeah. More. Uh, uh, it, it's going to all break apart. Yeah, it'll explode. Break yeah. apart, right? Yeah, explode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It'll break <laughs> apart. Uh, like... Uh, Yeah, more. Like there's no, there's no, um, nothing to hold on to. Right. I'm. Uh, it's, it's just like. I mean, it's kind of like. Uh, it's like I'm going to lose my mind or something. Good, good, good. Lose self, lose my mind. Yeah, it's going to go crazy. It might go crazy. That's what happens when people, you know, they get successful, they go crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of like that. Yeah, it's like, go crazy, yeah. Hey, whose philosophy is that? My parents. What? Don't tell me. Who? You're what? My parents. I'll be darned. I would never have guessed that. Do you remember a particular scene when they pushed this game? They're warning you, aren't they? That you better not keep on going in this quest for success because... All of that's going to happen. Yeah. Then you'll stay among us. Yeah, I have a bunch of scenes for that one. Yeah. 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 You're going to lose your family. You're going to be in exile. Doesn't seem so bad. <laughs> <laughs> come on, where did this come from? Yeah, I mean, I have... Uh, I have two scenes that come to mind. Go ahead. Um, How old? One of them is like five. Good. The other one? The other one is seven. M more recent. Like more recent? Okay, go ahead. Fifteen. I'll take five. Go ahead. <clears throat> the five is we uh, we just moved we just, I, I don't know how much I should, we just moved to Germany. Go ahead. And, um, you know, we we fled the war. Huh? We escaped from the war. Yeah, yeah, okay. Or just got out just before. And um, we're, we're living in, um, we're living in a kind of a community housing situation where there's a lot of uh, kids, where there's a lot of kids playing. And um, I'm I'm out there with these kids, and we are uh, we're sliding down the rails on the steps. We get on it, and then on our stomachs, and then we slide down, and it's really fun. It's a great time. But then um, my dad like snatches me mm -hmm. away from that, and then he takes me into the room. And then he gives me kind of a lecture. A pep talk. <laughs> pep talk. <laughs> exactly. Wow, maybe it's not a pep talk. It's exactly the opposite of a pep talk. No, oh, okay. What did he do? What did he play on you? <laughs> he, um, like, he, he took, he kind of like, he was explaining to me how fragile I am. Oh, because <laughs> he saw you were fragile at that moment. He said... No, wait a minute. Right. No, go ahead. Right. He um, was explaining how dangerous that was, and he was, he kind of, he, he, took my, he took my hand, and he was like grabbing my hand, and he's saying, 
you see this? This is very soft and weak and like fragile. Yeah. So he was, he's like trying to, yeah. he was really explaining to me that how, you, how fragile, fragile you were. Yeah. Yeah. And you shouldn't do that. Right. What was that you were doing that he saw? Having an amazing time. Mm. And what is he trying to keep you from? I still remember how good that was. Uh, from being myself. Yeah. And from doing what I love. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. That's how it happens. And it's not. And he, he looks so certain and knowledgeable. He looked, very, he looked very caring. And care, oh yes, so caring. So caring. Oh. Like he's telling me... The truth. What's best for me. Yeah, and the test he did is so perfect. <laughs> no? <coughs> no? No. No, no, he... I mean, if you want to tell how someone is strong, it's good to... to <laughs> no? Is Barbara, is Barbara right? I don't think it's... Uh, Regular procedure to do that. Well, what should you have said to him at that moment? Hmm. I should have said that Hey, you're like tricking me, trying to trick me into believing that I'm weak. That's true, but that only deals with one part of what's going on. And, um, and like, um, I, I guess I could. Maybe ask him, like, what is it about me having such a good time that made you want to tell me this now? Mm. Mm. Better, not good enough. See, the answer has to include everything you know in your answer or it's not complete. <coughs> now, wouldn't you agree? He really is a knower, and at that moment he really knows. I mean, then, then he knows a perfect way to demonstrate it by holding on to the part of your body that would show the ma massive strength in the wrist, because that's where people have muscles, don't they? Right. No? I guess I could also say that... Um... He's testing, he's trying to prove to you that you're fragile. It's not in your answer. Right. <coughs> well, yeah, I can also say that, uh, you know, that's, that's a nonsense way of showing me that I'm fragile. Like, mm -hmm. this... One part, go ahead. J just because you touch my hand doesn't mean that I'm fragile. Yeah. Or, and it doesn't prove anything. Yeah. You're not, telling, you're not telling him the state of mind you were in that he used at that moment to make this point. Oh, yeah. I could say it's very... Uh, were you being successful in what you were doing? Yeah. Oh! I was flying. Is, what? I was flying. Mm -hmm. Oh, flying! Yeah. Yeah. It was great. Uh, by the way, is it likely that at that time you knew how well you were doing in terms of the other kids? Were they all doing... That's the... very likely, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I was very um, uh, alert and open and uh, seeing. That and... probably didn't play a role in using that event at this time that you showed those, no, those, I... those qualities. I think it did. Well, why don't you add that to your story and tell me and what you're going to tell him? So I could say that um, you're using my openness to inflict 
your bullshit teachings. <laughs> <laughs> and you look, uh, and how does he look? And you look like you give a shit, but really you're, you look like you're shutting a, me you down. Look, you look like you really care. Yeah, you look like you really care and you're but in very on. wise and but in reality, you're not. Mm. And actually, you're doing a lot of harm. Mm. <laughs> and it's unjust. Mm. See, he's no dummy. You're in Germany. They're going to push excellence. What's he warning you about? Excellence. I realized recently also that a big Pathologos um, theme or milieu is being the foreigner. Mm -hmm. And our whole time in Germany perfectly plays into that because my parents are always assuming that um, persona of the foreigner. They don't know how to speak German, they don't know how to speak English, they never tried to learn. And it's, that fits in because it's like, see, it's, you're, I'm not one of the Germans. Yeah, see, all of that is what you know, and now you want to tell him at that moment what he's doing. So, so that's all good. Yeah. Now can you put that in a statement? And by the way, does he fear success himself? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Could you add that to the story? I could add a lot, it looks like. I could say, like, your, um, y like, you're, you're teaching your own son to be an outsider and not to be part of excellence, to be a black sheep mm -hmm. and not to be friends with excellent people mm -hmm. as well. Yes, yes. And um, it's just it's the opposite of a pep talk. Yeah, just yeah. Just setting yeah, me up yeah, for a... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you could include, could you include in that your view of him and his problem? Is that his problem as well? Does your father have the same fear? He does, yeah. Could you not tell him that what you're trying to teach me is finish it? What you're trying to teach me is to be closed in and that you see in just like yourself. Right. Yeah. What does that do? Well, it's it's more of a yeah. <laughs> More of a punch. Yeah. What does it do to you to say it? Now. Well, it's good because it, it kind of gets it off me and... Puts it on? Puts it in his court. Thank you. Yeah. Good show. This is yours. Thank you. Pleasure. Okay. It was so fast and yeah. smooth. And it's interesting that he focuses on this part, like, that's the very part that's so cool. I like that question you have about the role of grammar.